Greetings, greetings, greetings. After the showdown of Baal between Elijah, God, and Baal's God, and God answered through Elijah by fire, and all was destroyed. That was in 1 Kings, the 18th chapter. You can read the whole 18th chapter. After that, after that great victory, after that great victory, in the 19th, in the 19th uh, chapter, we find Elijah running and hiding under, under a juniper tree and requesting and requesting unto God that he might die. And so there's two things that happened. There was a great victory. God used his man. But then in the 19th in the 19th chapter and the fourth verse uh, Ahab told his wife Jezebel all that he had done all that had happened and uh, Jezebel sent a messenger unto the man of God and said might know tomorrow what happened to them the same thing will happen to you and Elijah became afraid and ran and hid upon a juniper tree and requested to die there's two things I want to say to you uh, and you're just listening to me the first thing I want to say is that you're at a place where you're questioning yourself. You're questioning your ability. You're questioning your faith. And you're questioning God. You're questioning God. And see the thing about it, God then gave you victory or something. But for some reason in your mind, you still got to question it. God blessing, God has opened up doors. God is doing some stuff. But still back in your mind, that voice don't want to let go and want to question stuff. And this is the direct word for someone. I don't know who it is. Stop questioning him. God said, stop questioning him. And see, that's what the enemy wants you to do is question God. Question your faith. Because when you question, you, you got doubt. You got doubt. You're not believing. And so this is the plan. This is the plan of the adversary. The adversary wants you to question yourself. He's wanting to question your ability. Question everything that you do and make you feel as though you're useless. And see, this is how this man of God felt. After God had done all of that for that, all that for him, used him greatly, he felt useless. He felt like he would even, don't even compare to his forefathers, stuff like that. Shake yourself. Shake yourself and come out of that rut. Shake yourself and come out of that mindset. That's the enemy trying to, trying to get you to question your blessing, trying to get you to question your breakthrough, trying to get you to question your, question your healing. Stop questioning God. Are you listening to me? Are you hearing me? Is that all right? Stop questioning.